Hello, I'm Rachel Briggs, the founding executive director of Hostage US. I was so sorry that we had to cancel our second annual reception this evening. But what I am pleased to say is that without exception, our sponsors stepped forward and insisted that we convert their sponsorship money into donations. In particular, I would like to single out our platinum sponsors, the Brahma Putra Foundation and Coca-Cola, who continue to give us vital, vital support in this important work that we do. I had hoped that this evening's event would give me one final opportunity to say goodbye and thank you to all of the amazing people who've helped us on our journey so far before I step down as Executive Director on April 30th to our volunteers, to our strategic partners, to our advisory council members, our donors, our staff and our board members, thank you, thank you. This month, we celebrated Hostage US's fourth birthday. And in just four years, what we've achieved together has been extraordinary. We have helped many, many scores of families and hostages through their darkest of times to a life of recovery and hope. We have pulled together over a dozen amazing strategic partners who have delivered hundreds of thousands of dollars of pro bono support to our families and hostages every year. We have an amazing advisory council and committed donors who keep giving year after year. I am so pleased that as I step down, I'm able to hand the baton to Liz Frank. Liz joined the Hostage US team on pretty much day one and working alongside her, I have seen her to be somebody who has tremendous dedication to this mission, is committed to everything that we seek to achieve together, has got outstanding instinct, and I have full confidence that she has the skills and the qualities to take Hostage US to the next level in the coming years. None of this would have been possible if it were not for the kindness and generosity of the American people. And like me, I'm sure that you're seeing that day in, day out right now, small and large acts of kindness as we all come together as one national community to get through this terrible coronavirus crisis together. And just as we at Hostage US seek to walk alongside hostages and their families through their recovery. So you, the American people, have walked alongside me over the last few years as I have sought to create, grow and strengthen this amazing organisation. From the bottom of my heart, thank you. And please, stay committed to Hostage US. We need you now more than ever. I'm Liz Frank, the new Executive Director of Hostage US. Since the beginning, I've been working alongside Rachel to deliver support to families and hostages, and I'm incredibly proud to take on the leadership of this organization. When we started Hostage US, we often talked about why we're in and why we're invested in the mission. After having worked with just one family in the beginning, it was clear to see the need for an independent care and support system to walk alongside these families as they navigate the unimaginable trauma of having a parent a sibling or a child taken hostage abroad. Over four years later, now having supported so many families through this unimaginable trauma, I'm in because I know that we make a tangible difference in these families' lives and we continue to ease the burden of what is the worst time in their lives. Because of COVID-19, we had to cancel our annual reception meant for tonight, but these families need us now more than ever. Families going through a hostage situation now have to navigate a global pandemic, adding stress, anxiety, and fear to what is already an anxious situation. They have to worry about the safety of their loved one abroad while worrying about the safety of their loved ones here at home. I wanna thank our platinum sponsors for the annual reception who allowed us to keep their sponsorship, the Obama Future Foundation and Coca-Cola. Thank you. I also want to announce a fundraising campaign that we're running in light of the challenges that we're facing because of COVID-19. The Day of Giving Global Giving Campaign on May 5th. Please consider donating 
$5, to mark the date 5-5-2020. One of our very generous individual donors has offered a match campaign up to $20,000 throughout the month of May. Please consider starting off the month right and donating on May 5th. Your contributions will go directly to building out our programs and partnerships, most notably our hospital partnerships across the U.S., who offer returning hostages full medical care when they get home so that they can start off their rebuilding process and make sure that they get off on the right foot. We'll also continue our programs to develop our support teams who offer face-to-face -face support to families on a day-to-day -day basis. I look forward to updating you on our successes in the year and years to come and want to thank you sincerely for your contributions, your partnership, and your support. Thank you.